It's a nice day today and I'm wearing wellies. And that's all I really wanted to say. Not really. So there's been no trains running for a while, uh, but there's no reason why at any point I can't come out here with a track rubber and a brush and get some trains running. And I thought I'd do that today just for fun. And also because I've just finished making two new shunters. This tree's fallen down. I'm gonna have to pull it up, I think. Uh, I don't know quite how that happened. Now this is the bit I always dread, tree corner. It's such a mess this time. I've got to sweep the whole thing out. There's a strange smell here in tree corner and I don't know what it is. I'm not very good with smells, you see. Well, I'm good at making smells. I'm just not very good at identifying them. But anyway, I've, I've cleared out tree corner and uh, in theory, the line should be all up and running now and I have managed to get um, a loco to kind of stutter along the track but I think to be honest it's too damp out here and that's stopping things working properly. Uh, there's not a lot I can do really but I can show you the two locos I built recently. These shunters, I built them really for a bit of a joke. <laughs> um, the purple one's called Mrs Bucket, it has a lady driver and the other one's called Russ Bucket and uh, you can probably see why and on my test track upstairs they run perfectly well so I know it's not the locos it's just the railway so I guess that's it for now sorry no garden railway till the summer I don't think uh, and I shall await the influx of comments from RC and battery power enthusiasts saying I told you so you did tell me so what can I do <laughs>